Thank you for calling you as food this Gina may help you. Uh yeah, so are you the one who's texting me? I had just texted a a driver that had, uh was interested in the on site hiring event at US Foods for a class A driver. Okay, okay, then that's me. That's me. Uh can you give me a little bit more Hello? Yeah, can you hear me? Hello? Hello? I can hear you. Oh, okay. My can name is Gina. Uh, I'm the okay. I'm the recruiter for the driver position. Okay. In Twinsburg. Okay. Because I when I dialed the number, you're out of Illinois. So that's that's where the company is at, is out of Illinois. Uh US Foods Corporate Headquarters is in Rosemont, Illinois. Oh and I'm helping with the driving event. From the facility at our corporate recruiting office. Oh, okay, 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 okay. All but right. the actual hiring event is at our Twinsburg facility. Okay, so at, at this hiring event, what 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 do it all entails? So what it is is a conversation slash whatever interview with my hiring manager, mm -hmm. a road test, mm -hmm. and if you guys think it's a fit they would offer you the position. We do do a background check on our drivers, mm -hmm. um, which takes about a week. But our position is Monday through Friday. It's a local driver position delivering food products. U.S. Foods is a food company. We would have you deliver food products to restaurants, schools, occasionally a stadium or a hospital. Primarily, we deliver to independent restaurants. Mm -hmm. um, our drivers make ten to fifteen stops throughout the day. Okay. Um, can I can I stop you right? Compensate. Can, can can I stop you right there? Yeah. Um. All right. Sure. So, uh, with 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 all the stops to these different places that we be doing uh, every day, uh, is this a driver? Uh, assist or like touch freight do we gotta take the freight off and then take it in and then set it up that that's we gotta do that it is, it is touch freight you would take it off the truck and bring it in you don't need to set it up or quote unquote merchandise it but it is heavy touch freight okay and you said this is like we, we would do anywhere between 10 and 15 stops a day Yes, sir. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, what? Okay, so let's back it up to the uh to to the event. So after, after so we will actually do the driving test in in what a, a a sleeper or a day cab? No, it would be um a day cab. We don't use sleepers, and it would probably be. A smaller trailer, not a fifty-three foot, maybe twenty-eight. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, manual or automatic? We have both, but ninety percent of our fleet is automatic. Oh, okay, okay. So you would road test for sure in an in an automatic, not a manual trans. Gotcha. So basically, this is is this a uh, slip seating? Or would I be assigned a truck? Say that one more time. I'm sorry you broke up. Would this be slip seating or would I be assigned a truck? So in there's a little bit of flexibility. So most likely you would not be assigned a truck until you complete training for three months. Whoa, three months. Okay. Uh, since you mentioned that, what's so we'll we'll go out with another driver and and uh, and I well I, 
I'm sorry. You don't get a set schedule in a dedicated route until they think you're fully operational in our ways. It's not that you wouldn't be on your own sooner than that, but I don't think they would assign you a truck and a route until every you know everything is complete and trained. Oh, okay. It could take three months for some drivers who have experience and pick it up quicker. It could be sooner. Okay. So again, we we will go out with another. We will go out with another another driver, right? Yes, in the training period you would, but after you're fully trained, it's a one-man show. We don't have driver helpers or assistants, but in the training period, yes, you definitely go out with another driver. Okay, okay. Um, would this be uh, hours of service regulated? Will, will we be up under hours of service, uh, you know, doing the driving and delivery? Yes, sir. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Um, all right. Go. Ahead. I, I'm sorry for break. Uh, you know, for for breaking you up. But go ahead and continue telling me about the uh, the event. Oh, that's okay. I just wanted to tell you. Um, the compensation starts at twenty two sixty. After ninety days. You go to twenty three sixty. On top of the twenty three sixty, there's also a driver incentive program, so you get compensated with component pay, which means it's per case, depending on the number of stops, depends on the per case pay rate. Typically, our first year drivers make about seventy or seventy five thousand dollars. Okay. Um, Monday yeah. through Friday. Okay. Uh, you say so. This is so we're not getting paid per mile. We're, this this is salary or hourly. No, no, you're not getting paid per mile. You're getting paid per hour okay. and then per component pay. So even if you're sitting, you're getting paid when you go in on your first day for training. You're getting paid. You're always making the twenty two sixty to start twenty three sixty after ninety day probation. Okay. Now let me ask you this. Do now you, you mentioned something about, you know, ten you know, I am I'm, I'm just going off the low end. You said ten stops. Do we get paid for individual stops or is that or is that included with our hourly pay? The component pay pays you for cases delivered, so if you make 15 stops, let's just say, mm -hmm. your case pay is going to be, this is just example, sir, okay? Mm -hmm. So if you make 15 stops and you deliver a 1,000 cases, let's say it's 50 cents a case. Mm -hmm. If you make 12 stops and deliver a 1,000 cases, your pay is 48 cents a case. So it's based on your productivity. The more stops you make and the more deliveries you make, cases you unload, the more you pay. It's rewarding drivers because it's such hard work for delivering bigger loads. Okay, okay. And I'm 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 assuming that uh that this you know being that it's hourly, I'm home, I'm home daily and off on the weekends. Right, right. All right. So if that's what you're looking for, I definitely encourage you to come to the event on Saturday. Um, the hiring managers give you a lot of specifics, a lot of details. Um, but what I just told you is the gist of the position. Monday through Friday, hourly, component pay, just as I mentioned, heavy touch freight. Okay. Now, you mentioned in the, in, in the text that you guys is offering... A 10k sign-on bonus. I got a two-part question on that. Uh, the first yeah. part, the first part question is, when would it be paid out? And the second part question is kind of like, it's kind of like open. Why is the sign-on bonus so much? Why is the what? 
why is the sign on bonus so much why why is the sign on bonus 10k okay got it got it first of all the sign on bonus is super high because there is a massive need for drivers so a lot of companies are hiring and there's not a lot of drivers so we're trying to encourage drivers to come to us okay um okay we just picked up a huge account of kent state university you may have heard of it um mm -hmm. so we really need drivers and we're short drivers um the sign-on bonus, full disclosure, is paid out in two over two years. Mm. So at um, 90 days, you get 1,250. At 60 days, you get another 1,250. At a year, you get 5,000. At a year and a half, you get 1,250. At two years, you get the balance. Oh, okay, so this is so this is not no. so this is not this is not break down like monthly. This is like every ninety days per, right? It, right, just like what I said, it, it's broken out, and I do want you to be aware over two years. Gosh. So if you only stay with us for, you're really only getting seventy. You're only getting. Um, Seventy five hundred. Wow. So it is paid out over two years with the balance at the two year mark. Okay. But it's an incentive to get people to come to us because if you amortize that over the two years, it is like even an extra dollar an hour on top of your pay. Okay. 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 Uh, so at the hiring event, uh, I, uh, what, what are the credentials I need to bring with me? We just need you to bring your CDLA and your medical card. Oh, okay. All right. And we'll That way, for insurance purposes, mm -hmm. we would have it for the road test. All right. Now, as far... Now, let me ask you... Now, let me ask you a question. Uh, I'm not a felon, but I, I do know a lot of... I do know a lot of drivers that have... Uh, felon backgrounds uh do you guys uh mm -hmm. do you guys have a policy on that because you know i could probably if not i you know i might not be able to but do you guys have a policy on felons bring we do hire with some background infractions i'm not the background team but i've been doing this long enough and i can tell you unless we only go back seven years and unless if it's what you would call very, very serious or grievous murder, um, super, super serious, we would not be able to hire you. But if it was something like uh, not super serious, one charge, we do hire people with um, things on their background. Okay, okay. Uh, uni uniforms? Yes, no? Yes, we would... We would provide um, U.S. Foods logoed Uniform. uniforms. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Well, uh, that sounds uh, sounds pretty cool. And you said that the uh, that the hiring event is tomorrow. No, it's actually Saturday, June tenth. Uh, you. And this is LaShawn, right? You you know we're in July, right? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> July 10th. <laughs> sorry about that. <laughs> I'm over here like, June 10th? Oh, you, you know we're in July, right? <laughs> okay, okay. Sorry about that. Oh, no, you're, no, no, you're good. Um, Before I get off the phone with you, what, um, what, what can get us disqualified? So, I'm just afraid. I don't have a specific list. Okay. Um, so, I can't really answer that. It's a case-by-case -case basis, and it's made 
The determination is made by the background team, not myself. Okay. Well, that's what's up. That's what's up. All righty then. Well, uh, thank you very much. Um, something that I would... Uh, Thanks that... for catching my mistake, too. Oh. Oh, no problem. No problem. I'm so glad. <laughs> yeah, no problem. I'm so glad you noticed that. Thank you. <laughs> if you do come up with that, if you do come up with any questions, please don't hesitate to call me back, but I hope you can make it. I think you'll find our team is really cool and US Foods is a great place to work. All right, all right. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll do some consideration. Uh, if I don't, I will definitely pass this information on to uh, to other drivers that uh, that might be interested. You know, I'll pass it on to them. Sounds good. I appreciate that. And you say it's, you say it's July 10th, next Saturday, right? Exactly. All right, all right. I'll go ahead and uh, I'll go ahead and pass the information along. Thank you very much, ma'am. Thanks, Lashawn. Have a nice fourth. All right, now. U.S. Foods. You guys heard that. Now, here's uh, here's some things that you need to know right off the bat. The 10K sign-on bonus is only paid out three months at a time. If I'm not mistaken, if, I mean, you know, you might have to go back and re-listen, but I think it is three months at a time, okay? Um, and it's paid out over two years, okay? So, in that instance, just think of the uh, sign-on bonus as, and it's it, not, not as an incentive, but just as an add-on on top of what you be on what you be making all right so don't don't think of it as a sign-on bonus because again sign-on bonus is pretty much when you sign on you get paid you know not not to get paid over a period of time <laughs> you know hell 10k five grand the first six months and five grand the second six months that that should be a nice little payout right there but i digress um the hiring event is saturday uh july 10th uh bring your cdla and your med card uh you might have a better chance of, of the road test because the truck and trailer is a little bit smaller. Know that you know that this is a this is work. Alright? This this isn't this this isn't friendly, man. This is work. I, I, I've seen them guys. This is like Cisco. I've seen them guys get into some situations. I've seen these guys that gotta <laughs> That gotta that that gotta move a lot of freight throughout the day, and she over here talking about 10, 15 stops a day, bruh. <laughs> you know, so if you ready to put in the work, they ready to give you an opportunity to uh, to 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 work for them. All right. Uh, again, U.S. Foods. Uh, I, I I could give you the phone number uh let's see it is if you want to get in contact with the young lady it is 847-720-2779 again 847-720-2779 all right um let me see. U.S. Foods. Uh, they got excellent conversation, predictable schedule, and miles. Medical, dental, vision, life insurance, uh, 401k plan, and a lot more that you might wanna that you might wanna ask about. But if you're a driver like myself, that's that's that know that you know the benefits is beneficial <laughs> then 
you know, you might want to give them a give them a try. All right. Uh, U.S. Foods is a recognized company, I think, you know, because I've seen they trucks all the time. They're located out of Illinois, but they do have terminals all over. Uh, this particular hiring event is for the, to, if I'm not mistaken, I'm going to say Ohio because I'm not sure uh, which terminal, uh, you know. But for the hiring event, this one is for Ohio. But if you live in any other state or any other region, you can still give them a try. Uh, I popped out the phone number. I think the website is drive for you. I mean, drive or for for the number four usfoods.com. US Foods, everybody. What do you guys think of this? Uh, what do you guys think? Are you guys interested in US Foods? Leave your comments in the comments below. Let me know. Uh, let me know what you guys think of US Foods. Is it is it a company that you would like to drive for? Let's find out. Anybody that works for US Foods, let us know in the comments below how it is to work there. All right. Well, that's going to do it for this episode of the Lockout Men podcast. MTC special edition uh US Foods uh hiring event June uh June she got me saying June July 10th that's this Saturday you want to know the time uh, you know what I forgot to even ask her what the damn time is but I'm going to assume it's in the morning eight o'clock in the morning eight eight o'clock in the morning sometime in the morning five o'clock in the morning uh i don't know it's gonna be sometime in the morning or in the afternoon i don't know just call her up find out what it is on that note everybody y'all take it easy i'll come back at you with another mtc uh get your suggestions in now let me know who you want me to call next or somebody that's gonna call me i'm just saying let me know who to call next let me know who to talk to get your questions get your suggestions in and support the cause because these calls are not sponsored so if you want to support the call you can you can do that by way of cash app and that's dollar sign lockout me all right support the call get a shout out get a shout out for that call all right until next time everybody y'all take it easy peace